Alright, yo, what's good everyone? Nick Smith is back. First off, if you guys want to see the next episode, give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new. But, originally, this video and a few other videos that I recorded was a live commentary, but this happened. Again. And the roster is pretty good. I don't know why this problem keeps happening every time I want to goddamn make a MyGM video. I'm doing a live commentary, and then my audio just craps out on me and just stops working. It happened um, with the last MyGM, ep no, two MyGM episodes ago it happened on me. It just keeps happening. So, I the last two days, there's a reason why I haven't been posting, obviously. First off, it was a live commentary. So, and you know, the audio just wasn't working. But by the way, three point game, four minutes left, oh, four seconds left, I'm going to hop in the game, see if we can play some defense to win the game. But, yeah, originally this was a live commentary, and then it just stopped working. It, the audio just crapped down on me, and I don't know, it just like doesn't work anymore. So, what I've done the last two days is just really just try to, uh, I guess try to fix the microphone. Because if you're hearing this video fine, then the mic is working, right? Because I'm recording it with the same microphone, I haven't got a new microphone. So if, you, if you're hearing this, then the mic is fine. So what I did was I reset my um, software that I record my gameplay and my um, audio file with. And uh, I just completely updated that and reset it. So uh, I downloaded it again. So hopefully the audio issue is fixed. But unfortunately, I recorded three MyGM Indiana Pacer MyGM... I don't know what I just said. I pretty much just recorded three MyGM episodes. And so that means the audio is bad for three of the episodes. So, um, yeah, hopefully it's all good. But, um, yeah, you guys might have to live with some post-commentary videos for the next couple of episodes. I, I really apologize. Um, but, yeah, unfortunately, I don't know what it is. Um, because, you know, my mic is fine if you're hearing this perfectly. So, I, I don't know, man. It's YouTube videos not liking me at the moment. And uh, I really just, I want to get everything fixed and ready to go. And, um, you know, I plan to, uh, first off, comment down below. And I want you guys to comment honestly if you would like to see my YouTube setup. If you guys would like to see how I make my videos and, you know, the, the setup that I play 2K with and all the stuff, you know, the monitors, TVs, speakers, all that good stuff. Comment down below leaving a comment, you know, if you guys want to see that or if you don't want to see that because that's important to me. I want to know because I do want to make a video like that, but I don't know if this is the right channel for that. Because if you guys don't want to see it, then I, I don't want to put something that you guys don't want to see. So I might just make a separate channel, honestly, and do different type of videos on that channel. Um, if you guys would like to see that as well. Or if you just don't want to see that, because some of you guys might not want to see gaming setups or YouTube setups. But I'm, I'm, I'm into that kind of stuff, really. Like, I'm not a big PC guy, or I don't really play much video games. But I do like the idea of having a nice desk and a nice room. Um, especially if you're a YouTuber. Um, having nice monitors or a TV or whatever like stuff like that. So yeah comment down below Would you guys want to see my YouTube setup? Um, and you know how I make my videos and stuff like that comment down below if you guys would like to see that or if you wouldn't And while you're at it, give this video a big thumbs up for the next episode as well The my GM episodes they're gonna be good from now on because obviously right now it's playoff time Playoff time is always a good time not only that once we finish the playoffs We're going into the off season we go into the draft uh, we go into free agency, we look at our new jerseys for next season, which is pretty cool. So, yeah, if you guys want to see, you know, the next couple of episodes, I recommend leaving that like, subscribing if you're new. And by the time this video is up, we are either at 38,000 subscribers or we're super close, which is pretty cool. So, you know, I don't know what we're going to be at by the time I upload this video. So I just want to say, if we are or if we're not, thank you for all the support. You guys always show support. And if you guys want to follow me on Twitter, um, you know, if you guys want to ever talk to me, always, you know, tweet me on Twitter. Because YouTube comments, they're harder to see. I try and read all of them, but it's harder to reply to all of them. So if you guys actually have a proper question you want to ask me, or if you, if you guys need somebody to talk to, yeah, definitely hit me up on Twitter. Give me a follow. And I, I have an Instagram account as well, but I never really post too much on that. But, you know, I started posting a little bit here and there, so... 
yeah, all the links to every, you know, all my social media sites are in the are in the uh, description down below. So yeah, definitely hit them up. But uh, right now, this is game seven. So I mean, we try and get a win out here. We're trying to win, uh, trying to win this series because well, it's it's first round, all right? It's first round. No, it's the second round. But the Charlotte Hornets, they're pretty good, right? They got Al Jefferson, Tyson Chandler, Kemba Walker, and Kemba Walker. Oh my goodness. He was killing it the other day in real life. He dropped like 53 points. He, uh, and by the way, we hop into this game right here. Um, but Kemba Walker, and by the way, also, Paul George has six fouls. So, yeah, we didn't get to play with Paul George in, uh, in the last couple minutes of this game. But Kemba Walker absolutely killed it. He dropped something over 50 points. He got a diamond card in 2K. And also, with uh, my team, there's going to be a new... Um, a new Kobe 81 diamond card, like an 81 point diamond card for Kobe Bryant um, soon, which is pretty cool. Look at that Jefferson hitting that hook shot right there to take the lead for the Hornets. But yeah, this is where it all happens. It's game seven. So if we lose this game, we don't advance to the next round. If we win the game, we're going up against the Cleveland Cavaliers. To be honest, I mean the Cleveland Cavaliers... <laughs> They're pretty good. And look at CJ Miles. He's actually injured right now. I don't know how. I just hopped into the game and he was injured. But look at that man right there. Miles Turner, the young blood, the rookie, whatever you want to call him. He threw it down over Al Jefferson, which is pretty sick, man. That was a nice dunk. Al Jefferson should have just let it be. But Miles Turner was like, you know what? Give me the Al one dunk. Unfortunately, you know, rookies don't have the best ability. And he misses the free throw. <laughs> I mean, most rookies can hit a free throw, but, you know, normally normally he makes free throws. But Miles Turner, yeah, obviously uh, didn't make that free throw right there. But with Paul George injured, we need, other, we need other players to step up, right? We need other players to step up. I size them up with D-Rose, and they come to the double team. You're leaving double G wide open. That's cash all day for Gerald Green. He gets that three to go and takes the lead for the Indiana Pacers, stepping up while Paul George is out. Because he's our second, uh, he's our small forward off the bench. So we need him to step it up. D-Rose playing that great D. Oh, no. He just got crossed up right there. And then Tyson Chandler hits that mid. Well, it wasn't even a mid-range. Kind of a short-range jumper right there. But I want to go quick right here. Do you know why? I got 30 seconds left and I want the last shot. So I went quick. I got fouled right here by Jeremy Lamb. And I'm at the line for two with D-Rose. Which means that I get the last shot of the quarter as well. D-Rose. Hits the first free throw right there. One point lead to us. Take your time, D-Rose. We've got to make this one right here. Give us a two-point lead, and then we don't have to give up a three. It makes that two-point lead right here. 27 seconds left in this game. We cannot give up a three. That's the main goal right now. Just don't give up a three. We play some good defense. It didn't matter. Tyson Chandler did the little hook shot right there. Got that to go. So now, I'm taking it up. It's D-Rose time. It's time to get this win I mean 11 seconds left remember back in the MVP days Derrick Rose was super clutch so he's going inside gets fouled by Kemba Walker almost gets the M1 unfortunately he missed the M1 that would have been dope but he did miss it so with 1.5 seconds left he makes the first one I, I thought that was gonna miss honestly I, I didn't think that was going in but then D Rose you have to be clutch right here and he misses the second one. It doesn't even matter because they didn't have enough time to get a shot off. So D-Rose won us the game in OT. I mean, not in OT. The last... Actually, yeah, was that in OT? No, it wasn't. I don't even know. I don't know. That might have been in OT. I forgot. But uh, yeah, we win that game right there, which is pretty cool. And now we're facing up against the Cleveland Cavaliers. Well, look at that. The Spurs got kicked out by the Clippers and the Warriors got kicked out by Portland. What in the world? Anyway, and the Thunder got kicked out by Minnesota. you got to be kidding me right now. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like, subscribe if you're new. That's the quickest I've ever talked. I'm out. Bye. <laughs> wow, that was quick. Oh, my goodness.